<laughs> the Maverick is reflecting this evening on comments made by West Indies coach Phil Simmons after the Sri Lanka series, defending the decision to play five bowlers, including the all-rounder and five specialist batsmen plus the wicket keeper. Simmons hinted that this is the way the West Indies will set up going forward. Of course, some people disagree, saying the balance of the team is not right and blah, blah, blah. But there is no universal playbook on how to balance a test team. It all depends on the skill sets of the personnel available to the respective teams. In this case, the West Indies, we can afford to play the extra bowler because the lower order with the likes of Jason Holder, Joshua De Silva, Raheem Cornwall, and even Alzari Joseph can more than help themselves with the bat. Plus, the alternative batsmen like Shea Hope and Darren Bravo and Shimran Hetmeyer, when they play, they're not performing any better than Holder and De Silva and company. So with the West Indies needing the extra bowler to consistently take 20 wickets in test cricket, I fully agree with Phil Simmons. <laughs> it makes total and absolute cricket sense for this West Indies team to continue to play the extra bowler at the expense of the extra batsman. The Maverick fully endorsed that one. <laughs>